Good morning, everybody. It's like 10 a.m., and apparently uh, there was a Mario Kart. There was this big thing about Mario Kart at 3 a.m. in my area, and I was up till 3 a.m., but I kind of, like, fell asleep. At, like, I literally started to fall asleep where I couldn't stay awake anymore at, like, 2.55, and then it was, like, 3.05, and I look at my phone, and it's like, screw this, I'm going to bed. I'm tired. So apparently there's a new trailer, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to watch it live and give like a live reaction. So at least there's something interesting that most of my main channel subscribers are interested in. Um, so, uh, uh, yeah, so let's figure it out. And Alright, let's see the new Mario Kart 8 trailer that was premiered April 3rd, 3 a.m. at my time. Oh, I can't wait to play this. Is Bowser in a pink race car? Okay, no, it's the same one from Mario 3D World, it looks like. I know, I'm really excited for, like, the... The turning, like how the raceways actually go up and turn to the side and stuff like that. But I know my friend Hayden won't be able to play it. He said it's kind of like that kind of visual will make him kind of just feel sick. And I, I probably other people may feel like that, but I mean, I'm still good to play this. Oh, baby Peach's card has a little tail like a kitty. Rainbow Road. Holy crap. Oh my god, the N64 nostalgia. Oh my god, I just used this, a remix of this in one of my videos. Oh, Nintendo, you bring out the nostalgia so hard. <laughs> I need this game right now just for that Rainbow Road. Oh my god, it's a remake of the N64! More Rainbow Road! Yes! 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 That music. Oh god, I love... So basically this trailer just showed us that there's a remake of the um, N64 Rainbow Road. Like, that music is my dream. Alright, so yeah, now I really need Nintendo to release, um, I'm pre-ordering this most likely, maybe, actually, I don't know if I'm pre-ordering the game. The only thing that's going to make me pre-order Mario Kart 8 is if there's a special bonus released for North America. So, you know, that's just me. Uh, I like my special little items with my game's limited edition little collectibles. So that's the only thing that really makes me pre-order. So hopefully I can pre-order and it's available everywhere, not just GameStop. Because when I got the Legend of Zelda Collector's Edition, um, Wind Waker HD that came with the Ganondorf uh, figurine, I was happy about it. But what really annoyed me was that, you know, it was GameStop only. And the fact that it was actually $5 more expensive than what the suggested retail price was listed on the web on the internet. Like, all the, the video game Nintendo reporting news sites listed it as, I believe, $54.99 as the suggested retail price, if I'm not, if I'm correct. And it ended up being $59.99, and I'm just kind of like you know, grumpy face, mad face, whatever face you want to make that is not happy that you take $5 more than what you intended to because $5 adds up if there's other games that you plan to pay $5 less for. But, um, just because I literally, I literally do everything I can to save every penny. So, yeah, Mario Kart 8, I can't wait! Ah, oh, Rainbow Road! 
Rainbow Road!